Welcome to a new Stream Deck video. My name is Nico and today I want to introduce you to the new Beta SDK for Stream Deck based on Node.js. You can install the new SDK from NPM, which is really handy and I want to show you how that works real quick. So you have NPM here. Um, this is the NPM library website and here we have our package. And this is all you need to do to run uh, and ins the install of the new SDK. I want to show you now how you can use the SD uh, SDK and the uh, creation wizard that is already teased down here in uh, VS Code in a live demo. So here we now have uh, Visual Studio Code. And all I have to do is open a new console. For me, I have to set the execution policy for PowerShell. Now I can run stream, now I can run uh, stream deck, create, and this will enter the ex, uh, the creation wizard i can now say that i'm the author and i will call this demo plugin and now i've already have a proposed uuid for the plugin so we can just accept this and this is a demo and now i can create the plugin based on that now we are enabling developer mode in stream deck we are generating the plugin installing all required dependencies and once this is done we will have our very first simple plugin so you can see now it's uh, being built. And it will now quickly run you through the code of the plugin. So we have our source code. And yeah, then it asks me also if I want to open it in VS Code as I am already have it open in VS Code. My answer is no. All I have to do now is um, switch into the demo plugin folder. All right, so I have my source code here. Um, you can see I have the general plugin TypeScript file here. So this is pretty much the main. And then I have all my actions in here, for example. And what this plugin does is an increment counter. Um, to run the plugin, all I have to do is do npm run watch. And now we are building the plugin. We are restarting Stream Deck and linking the plugin so we can actually test it out live on Stream Deck. And let me show you that you, our demo plugin is now live on Stream Deck. And down here we have it. We have an action called counter. Um, it's an increment counter. And whenever I press a key, it is incrementing. So let's go back to VS Code and change um, something in our increment and then update the plugin. So what we want to do is uh, double the increment. So I just copy paste um, this line here, I'm going to save it. This will trigger the SDK to um, rebuild the plugin and hot reload the plugin in Stream Deck. And now if we switch back to Stream Deck, whenever I'm pressing the key, now I'm incrementing by two. So you can see whatever you just did has an immediate effect on your plugin. So check out the document uh, documentation for the new SDK and have fun developing plugins. Thank you.